The Wood Shop is sponsored by Chefware Kits with hundreds of items for wood turners. Guten Tag, welcome back. I'm gonna make a beer mug today and I put this cool antler handle on it and I'm gonna use my own home brew. It's kind of like Heineken, but with extra MSG. All right, let's go ahead and get started. I just trued up all the discs on the lathe. It would have been much easier if on the walnut pieces here, I made a small groove in them so that it locked in the other pieces. It would have been easier for lining them up when gluing it all together. And I know, I know, I couldn't find any German music that wasn't copyrighted, so Scotland, here you go. I used a two inch Forstner bit. That way the chuck and everything went right inside and I didn't have to put on an extension bar. It made it much easier. All right, I'm just gonna go ahead and dry sand this because I want I need to epoxy the handle on. So I'm gonna turn dust collector on and do that real quick. All right, I have it sanded up to 600. I'm gonna go ahead and take my, I have an antler here that I found when I was out hiking one time I ran across a shed spot and there were got about six of these so um, I'm not quite sure what I'm gonna do it'd be cool if we wrap around there a little bit but I think I'm gonna end up cutting it off cutting it off flat like that so I'll mess around with it on the bandsaw a little bit and keep testing it until I find a good spot on it all right Make sure you have plenty of ventilation when you're working with this antler and even a respirator will help out a lot. It stinks really bad. All right, so I just cut off some of the pieces on the bandsaw and then took it over to the little drum sander and cupped it out and it fits right on there. I had to play around with it quite a bit, but it I got to get that little arc, but there we go. So I'm gonna epoxy this on and actually I'm gonna part, part it off first and then I'll epoxy it on there and then put a finish on it. All right, and then I'll just cut that little nub off. So I got the handle handle on and I ended up going with Gorilla Glue. I have the kind that expands because it's just barely touching on the wood down here. So I, and it was gonna use epoxy, but I wanted something that expanded a little bit and got as much, much grip on there as possible. All right, and I'm just gonna use walnut oil and on the inside and out. And if it's more for decorative, if you were gonna use it to actually drink out of, you could um, seal up the inside of it with, uh, with something else but the walnut oil will give it a nice nice finish I'm gonna put a little bit on the horn here too where I had to sand I just want to see what it'll what it'll do it's 
got a little bit light. All right, so I'm just gonna finish putting this on and then uh, I'll wipe off the excess. All right, there we go. I really like the handle. I like the little eye guard I left on there. I think it, that looks nice. I'm not sure what the main wood is, but the two rings are walnut. But I hope everybody has a wonderful uh, Oktoberfest. Danke for watching, and don't forget to subscribe. Auf Wiedersehen.